Hello, this is Kyle Stringham here with Canopy Mortgage. Hey, today we're going to go through my welcome packet. So say you're a prospective buyer or you're one of our real estate partners or you're you know, looking at purchasing and you've received this packet from your real estate agent. This is kind of a welcome packet for the mortgage process and the real estate process and what we want you to expect. See, what we find is a lot of buyers don't have the information. They don't know what to expect. And because they just kind of, you know, people have them take it by the seat of their pants, you know, and fly through the process it really can be pretty chaotic and stressful. And so we find that if you have the steps available to you and kind of follow along as we get things done, or if you have questions, you can refer back to this or contact us. It allows things to go much smoother and you to be stress-free, okay? So this is our welcome page and I'll kind of just run through a few of these areas really quick. And um, I will let you read the contents of the packet, the steps, but um, this is what you can expect and our commitment to you to provide a great experience. So the next page is really a welcome note, thanking you for working with us. And then a personal note from me that explains this packet, um, much of what I just um, talked about. And let's get to your next page. So this is our team meeting us. Me is Kyle Stringham. And then also my loan officer assistant, um, her experience in the mortgage industry, and then also our incredible team at Canopy Mortgage. We have a corporate mortgage team that does everything from origination to processing to underwriting to closing and funding. Okay, that's really important because it's a whole experience. We're not a mortgage broker. We're not putting you off to the lowest, you know, whatever lender is going to pay the most money, hoping that you'll make it through their process. We know that our pre-approvals are strong and we are going to close you on time. So that is our commitment to you here at Canopy Mortgage. Now, the next one is, is um, really the 10 steps of the mortgage process. OK, so I'll read through these quick. But again, I won't go through the page by page. So step one, we take your loan application. We submit docs. Step two, we create your initial loan estimates so that you can get an idea of what the mortgage will look like. You're pre-approved. You start looking for homes. We get out a pre-approval letter. Now you submit an offer. Number four, you submit an offer, you go under contract. Okay. Now this is when the mortgage process is really getting active. Now we'll finalize your application and you'll submit any additional, additional documents that we might need. Okay. Um, number six is conditional approval and appraisal. And you might be asked for some documentation. This is right up before you're closing on your home. It's getting really exciting. And then step seven, eight, and nine, really they can vary in order. And this is because, you know, everyone's got a specific loan type or a specific, um, you know, financial picture. And so we have to kind of adapt to make sure that we get your loan done as, as efficiently as possible. Now, this one is review and sign your initial closing disclosure. This is when you receive your CD, you sign it. And then right after that, we're going to announce that you are clear to close. So you go to your closing. And the last step is, is that we are going to wire funds to closing and your final closing um, CD. Congratulations. You're all done with your house. Pretty cool, right? So this gives the details of each of these steps and it lets you kind of work through them. Now, this next page is your 10 loan commandments. This is what you should not do when you are purchasing a home. Okay. So I'm going to breeze through these, but thou shall not quit their jobs. It's kind of biblical, right? Feel to this. Thou shall not buy a car, a truck, a boat, right? Or plan to live in it. Um, or unless you plan to live in it. Um, thou shalt not max out your credit cards. Okay. So you want to keep your balances in check and where they're at. Um, thou shall not close any accounts. This can negatively impact your credit after we pull your credit report, lowering your scores. And we do right up until closing, we monitor those um, credit scores. Now, thou shalt not buy any furniture or anything else until your loan closes. So don't go open any new accounts. Don't use any credit. Make sure that you're really holding off until the loan is closed. There's some really um, scary stories or very sad stories that we can tell about buyers that in the loan process decided to purchase something big, thus changing their debt portfolio or debt picture and it disqualifying them from the loan and them losing their earnest money. And the last one, or excuse me, the next one, thou shalt not become self-employed in the middle of your process. Again, not switching jobs. Um, thou shalt not make any large undocumented deposits into the bank or accounts 
and thou shalt not shuffle your money around, okay? So we have to document every dime, where it's coming from, that's used in a mortgage transaction. These are money laundering laws for the Fed. So we really have to be careful that we can document where your funds are coming from. So you don't want to put a large amount of cash in the accounts. You don't want any money to just show up. You want to talk to us as your loan officer before you do that, or say you're going to move money from your savings over to your checking at another bank. Talk with us because we will need to document that properly. And then the last one is thou shalt not co-sign for anyone. Okay. All right. So the next part really gets into the step by step, that one through 10 that we kind of ran through. And this lets you see what you're going to expect. Okay. And it's detailed. It's going to answer a lot of questions for you. It's going to help you through the loan process. And it really lets you, you know, um, know when we're locking interest rates, when we're ordering appraisals, when we're, you know, dealing with certain things. Um, how we're going to do it and things again that you should and shouldn't be doing okay so that's the next several pages i'd say that this is about five six pages long okay this is that process that you'll refer back to while you're buying your house and then the last one is really our uh, mortgage testimonials some of our clients um, that are raving fans of ours just so that you can um, know that we're committed to you and then the last one is just a page that lets communicate so something with our team and me, I am going to communicate every single week about your transaction or more, but you're at least going to be hearing from me once weekly. If everything's going extremely smoothly, then once weekly will be optimal for you because you'll know it's all handled. If an issue comes up because every loan is special, we will get in touch with all parties right away, make sure that we get it addressed and we get it back on the road. Anyways, you guys, this is our welcome packet. Um, I hope that you would um, work with us and I hope that you would see that our commitment to you for a great experience by providing this and bringing you into our very refined system is something that we would um, be honored for. So thank you again for checking out this video and I hope to talk to you soon. Reach out to us anytime. Bye.